Hey guys, today we ordered a bidet. This is a, a deluxe bidet. This is what 21st century living is all about. That's what it says. It says bidet is love, bidet is life. That's pretty cool. Cleaner than clean, your bottom's best friend. It says it's fantastic. If wiping has been troublesome or painful for you, this device is a blessing. I love all their little things on the front. This ain't a joke. awesome this is pretty awesome so this is a bidet what we're gonna do we're, we're gonna put a new toilet seat cover on we got that here as well as the bidet let's go ahead and uh, open up the uh, toilet seat cover and just kind of get it out of the way for right now now this is just a standard toilet seat cover the paper up that's it isn't this exciting why i'll tell you what it's probably one of the most exciting videos i've ever done comes with new nuts and bolts and uh, there it is brand new toilet seat cover how you think i think it looks great i don't recommend doing this after you use it but i just want to see if it fit so anyways, guys, we got a brand new toilet seat cover. I'm gonna set that down here on the floor for right now. Got some excited new bolts. Our old bolts were broken, so we got new bolts. Well, this is gonna be fun, but let's open up the bidet. Uh, let's just pull it open. It's got a little tape. Let's see if we can get around that real quickly here. They tape things up really good. There we go. Just a little piece of tape there, got it. So guys, here's what the kit looks like right out of the box. Let's uh, pull some of the pieces out here. It's wrapped nice plastic. It's got your hose to hook it up. Look, it's even got its own little wrenches and some inside here is some of the uh, tape that you use, the Teflon tape from leaks and stuff. This is the uh, Baudet itself. It's in a nice ziplac bag, like, it's just, uh, oh, I ripped it open, so. So here, this is the bidet itself. This is the unit that does, it has a wash thing. It's got one for women. It's got a wash and it's got a nozzle cleaning. And this is how you turn it off and on. It's got a little bit of a, that must be a sill. So there's the bidet itself. We'll find a nice place to put it. Don't want to lose nothing down into the, the sink. I'm going to leave that cover there. And then they have the Lux bidet. They have the instruction booklet. Let's take a quick look at it. All right. Tell us a little bit about it. You can register your bidet. I was saying yesterday, everybody have a, a bidet. Or is that a good day? So we can register it. Amazon, if you purchase this product on Amazon, you can follow the steps below to share your experience. I don't know if we're gonna share it all, but we might share some of it. It tells a little bit about the features. It's got a nozzle gate guard. It's got a self-cleaning nozzle. It's got a single versus dual nozzle. So it's telling us a little bit about bidets, but uh, they claim you dry. They show them using toilet paper. But you know, I think you could use a clean towel and then after you dry, you're already clean, dry yourself off. And then you can uh, go ahead and uh, wash your, your, your washcloth there. We're gonna go, it's got all kinds of product information here. 
I kind of know how this goes apart. Got a problem shooting area. So guys, I'm gonna set this on down, our deluxe bidet. And what we're gonna do first is get set up here and take off the old seat, add the bidet and go from there. So we're gonna start and take the seat off. Be right back. All right guys, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna remove the old toilet seat. And uh, basically to do that, there's a cover at the top here. Let's see if I can do it by hand. I think I can. We're gonna just, these are all plastic. And so it's really not too hard to do. Let's make sure we got our camera face just right. That's probably better. All right, we're gonna remove Move the old toilet seat. Now the other bolt on this one was broke. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna save this bolt. This is actually a homemade bolt. This is one that I used to get by with. We're gonna pull the old seat cover off. Just set it out to the side for right now. Get these TPs. Are you guys looking for this? We've got TP here. Maybe we won't need it anymore. We'll find out. So the first thing we want to do, we want to remove some stuff out of the way. But I don't know if you can see it. Down in here is a shutoff valve. What I want to do is just shut off the valve to the toilet and then flush it. Seat cover off in a minute. Now there's a little flapper down in here. I'm gonna see if I can show you that a little bit better. See down in here this flapper? We want to get as much water out of this as we can. In fact, I can splice some, but I'll uh, maybe even take a towel and dry some of this out so that we remove all the water from the tank because it, it'll leak out when we take it loose. So I'm gonna do that right this moment here. All right guys, first thing I'm gonna do, I don't know if you can see down on here with the camera, but there's just a nut. This should almost hand tighten. Now we're gonna probably see a little water. I'm gonna put a towel underneath here. That's good, a little bit of water, but not too bad. So now our next step, we have this package of fittings. I'm gonna open this up. So the first thing we wanna do is remove these caps. This is just so that no dirt gets in them. So we're gonna remove both of these caps. There we go. This part here, let's just see if that's gonna fit. Yeah, it looks like it's gonna fit good. This part goes up into here, and this part will hook to the bidet itself. So uh, we've got some uh, tape that came along with it. This is some silicone tape. What we're gonna do is go ahead and wrap some of this silicone around the bottom here. I had a little of my own of this uh, Teflon tape. What I'm gonna do here is do it while it's off. It'll be much easier. So there we goes, one of our fittings. And we're gonna take the other one and do it on here. This stuff wants to uh, collapse on you, but if you lay it out nice and flat, 
you should be able to get a nice wrap. And so then this part here is the part that goes to the bidet itself. I'm going to go ahead and screw it in place here. The neat thing about it, it really has this little built-in wrench that you can put it on it nice and tight yourself. I'm going to take this part here that comes from the water supply and uh, put it in place. There you go. All right, guys. I think what we're going to do at this point here, we have it all hooked up here. I want to turn on, make sure we don't have no leaks. So uh, let's slowly turn the valve on. We got a leak right away. <laughs> so let's reset this, this fitting right here once, make sure that. Pull that tape off. Sometimes that tape will give you a problem. Let's get that cleaned off. Um, let's try to screw that on carefully. we go that's better I don't think I had it fitted on there just right yeah you gotta be a little careful all right now I'm gonna put it too tight let's uh, position our they have these little things here that positions your cover so it fits different sizes and stuff and so I want to get those kind of put in place here there we go. Now let's try this again. So far okay. You know it takes a few minutes for a toilet to fill up. There it is. Okay, we look good. Let's do a flush. Just to clean out some of the debris and we're going to fill it back up again there we go now if you pull this up i believe it's working they have a woman's mode here oh i see that comes upwards and the uh, Clean nozzle. All right, so let's go ahead and get our toilet seat in place. So I'm just gonna try to hold this and put our cover in place. You can see it's kind of adjustable here. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'll come back. Just putting, we just gotta put these screws in. We'll get this in place and we'll be back. All right, we've got our bidet. Have a bidet. I can't help but say that. It's all installed. And I'm trying to show you some of the features without getting all squirted down. This is, uh, you can see how we hooked up. Let's see, we can get a good picture up in there. We did good, no leaks. The uh, bidet itself has three cycles. One all the way to this way is a cleaning nozzle. One in the middle is a wash. And one all the other ways is a woman's nozzle for the ladies. To turn it off and on, you pull up on this lever and this will allow the water to squirt out. You can see down into the unit here. I'm going to see if I can show you this. I'm going to put a little bit of a, a towel here. <laughs> Excuse the camera work. Maybe I'll just use my hand. Ooh, uh, yeah, let's do it this way. We're going to put a towel across here and see 
if it scorches. So, all right, this is the wash mode. You can see down in there. Let's see what it does. Whoa. You can see how it squirted. Man, it squirted all the way <laughs> up in there. So you can see what it does. The uh, cleaning nozzle is this way. That was the wash mode. We'll turn it on so we don't want to squirt our camera here. There, you can see down in there, it's cleaning the nozzle out for you. That's pretty cool. And then if I go all the way to the woman's mode, I'm gonna put this up. I don't know, we'll see if we can spot this around. It's a little hard to film. Do a little bit. You can see it up against the, the towel, how it squirts up there, does the cleaning process. One way is just a little different than the other way for the regular wash and the women's mode. So it uh, has more features, we'll go over some of it. I wanted to show you something else here while we got it up. If you see these extra rubber things, this was a cord wraps what this was, and I added that. I added these wraps to it, and I'm gonna see if I can attempt to show you with the seam down, being that the unit raises the back up a little bit, this will add support so you don't have a weak spot here in the middle. Oh, I show you. So see, this will keep that up there. That way you won't have a weak spot. You notice it's just a little higher in there, but time you put the pressure on it, this is very rubbery. This will keep maybe from breaking. You don't want your toilet seat to break, but you can see what I added those to it. We haven't tried it out, guys, and we're not going to demonstrate it. I don't think you even want us to. <laughs> but anyways, this is our insulation of our bidet. We're going to read up a little bit more on it and provide you more insulation. wasn't bad. Um, you know, I took my good old time, put it in there, make sure you didn't cross thread or nothing, and uh, success. So it looks like it's worked. We'll just have to try it out, guys. All right, guys, here's the uh, manual to the uh, Lux bidet. We installed it, so uh, this was the install version of it. Uh, if we run into more things, we'll make another video there and add to it. But this is actually the uh, model number uh, NEO180 of the Lux Bidet. Uh, we've been using this for a little bit now. I tell you what, this thing is awesome. We really, really enjoy it. With the uh, TP uh, crisis that we've had, this virtually eliminates even the use of TP, so I would invite you to get one of these. I'll leave a link available on Amazon. We'll leave a link up above or below, whichever way that comes out. But uh, check them out, guys. I hope you enjoy. If you got any comments, questions, leave it in the section below. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, I invite you to hit the subscribe button. We do all kinds of product reviews, and this happened to be the review for the Lux Bidet. We're really impressed with it. So give us a thumbs up. Appreciate it watching. We'll see you guys the next time. All right, if you want to see how to get some of our other links, when you go to our main YouTube page, up here in the picture area right here, you'll see it says like Facebook. You can click on that that'll take you right over to our facebook group and you're welcome you can join the facebook group uh add your videos add uh, whatever you meant do some discussion there but you can go there if you would like to uh, support us on the amazon again up in this picture you'll see a uh, link that says amazon click on that link right there go ahead and sign in make all your purchases and uh, what will happen here you'll give us a tip it, uh, we get a small percentage back. Costs you absolutely nothing, uh, but it does help us out and we appreciate that. But I just show you a few little links here if you want to uh, uh, go to some of the other features we have here at Lucky Dog Productions.